Don't underestimate the impact of Mark Zuckerberg's testimony in front of Congress this week, don't. Yeah, TV-hungry politicians grilling, grilling a billionaire hoodie boy, I, I got that, but the stakes are very high. First of all, you realize how much of the modern high-tech economy is based on the sale of your information? That's what Facebook does, you know. You get a great free service, and in return, Facebook sells your information. Amazon and Google do something similar. That business model has helped to fuel their astonishing financial power. Congress might try to unravel that model, or it could restrict it in some way. Remember when the Clinton administration went after Microsoft? Set them back a decade. Reign in Zuckerberg, and you reign in the shining stars of America's economy. Second, you realize how much of the Trump stock market rally is based on the amazing rise of those big tech stocks. About 40% of the multi-trillion dollar gain. Facebook, Amazon, Google, Microsoft and Apple. So think about the impact on your 401k if the politicians decide they just have to rein in young Mark Zuckerberg. Third, you are likely to see a great deal of billionaire envy at these hearings. The left will use the occasion to rail against Zuckerberg. He's worth 62 billion. And Amazon's Bezos, he's worth 116 billion dollars. They are walking examples of income inequality and another signal that we just can't allow these modern day robber barons to get away with it any longer. I'm saying the left will use these hearings to push tax the rich as we approach the November elections. In short, don't write off Zuckerberg's appearance. It will have impact. Last thought. If Facebook said, pay us a small amount and we will stop using any of your information for commercial purposes, I think most people would leave things as they are. That's the way I see it.